Hey guys, I'm LP, and I just heard a flip panel, so let's check out Paper 4, Taking the Back Seat, by Paper Player X. And, for those of you unaware, we played the first three parts in the 2017-06-30 livestream, so go check that out if you want to see them. The description says, I can't think of a name for this test, Jerry. Well, what are the test elements? Mostly faith plates. There's a light bridge and a laser, but they're kind of taking the back seat. I have an idea for the name. All right, let's get started then. Is this the colored cube? Yes, I think the previous maps also had colored cubes, if I remember correctly. Let's see. There is a deactivated faith plate. Interestingly enough, and there is an ant line going to that button. Okay. And yeah, this is the one that's deactivated. What about this one? Whee! This one's deactivated. Okay. Here's that light bridge. Ew. Well, okay then. Cannot use it... ...the normal way. Huh. I don't think I can get any use of this, really. Can I fit through this portal? No, I cannot. That's... yeah, I can't fit through that. So what I have to do instead... Oh! <laughs> Let's try that again, please. Let's not jump to our death this time. There we go. Is I wanna do... that. There we go. There we go. So now I can do this. Come on. There we go. Done that, and then, ideally, well, that works too. Oh, hello! I gets us a cube of some sort, and this just launches us back to square one. Right, so let's put this cube on this base plate and see what this does. This launches us up here. Interesting. So I should've put a portal there, probably. Let's go do that real quick. Uh-huh. This is sorta of giving me... Sorta of giving me vibes of that one test in the main campaign. I saw a deer today, is the one I'm thinking of. Whee! Did not even see that before. Interesting. I guess that's how we're gonna get a laser up here at some point. Right, but how do we get that? Why did I do that? I don't think I needed to do that. Let's see what's down here. Hello. Well, not entirely what I expected. I want to see if we can get that at all. No can do, no siree. Also, I need that cube now. Okay, so. Let us hop down here. Excellent. What does this do? A conditional laser, huh? 
Well then. How do I get out of here? I suppose I could do that, right? What was I standing on just then? Excuse me. Good sir, what was I standing on? What am I standing on? If I crouch, it pops me up here. If I uncrouch, it lets me fall back down. What am I standing on? Somebody explain this. What the heck? That's so strange. Must be some weird invisible collision or something. Right, what we can do... what can we do with this laser? Not a great many things, all things told. All things considered. In fact, I feel like I can do less things than I could do before. In fact, I feel like I need to be the one to stand on the button and the cube has to be pre-aimed. Pre That would open the exit, so I don't need to do that. That would... What does this do? Activate that, so I don't need that. What about- th what about this? That's still that button. How do I press that button, though? Hmm. Maybe we'll do it the traditional way? Like a normal person would? Yeah, that works. There we go. Alright. Pretty sure I can reach it this way. Yeah, definitely can. So, that's something you should consider in your map design. Maybe don't make that portable so that I can reach that qu so easily. If I'm supposed to be aiming a laser at that. How would I get the laser pointed there, though? That actually does not seem very doable. I am rather perplexed. How do I get that cube now? Cause that is in line... Yeah, I would have to have a laser coming out of here at an angle to aim at that, and I can't do that. That is not a thing that can be done. That light bridge is not too useful either. I could put something else on that button. Ooh. 
I know what I have to do. And it's not pretty. I can't even clear my portals. That's not nice. How am I- no, this doesn't make any sense, actually. How would that work? I don't think this is gonna work the way I'm hoping it's gonna work. See, my theory... ...is that I could do... ...this... Yeah, that's what I wanted to do, that's what I- this, that's what this entire setup was. But, now... ...that requires both of my portals, I do not have a, a three-portal guy. uh, a three-portal gun. Three-portal device. So there's not, not- not much I can do here, really. I can goof off, I suppose, but... Yeah, not much. Not much to do about that. Because as soon as I step off this button... And this would be angled enough, that if I shot it in the right place... <laughs> I am an idiot! Holy crap, I am an idiot! I don't need that flip panel at all! Also, the fact that the cube didn't move at all during that moment was amazing. That- that- that was like, the biggest, are you some kind of dumbass moment ever, that this game has given to me. <laughs> <laughs> I massively overcomplicated that. All right. Oh boy. I can already see the comments. <laughs> that was fascinating that that didn't move though. Yeah, whatever, I can- I can go realign it myself. <laughs> that is so strange. There we go. Huzzah! We have this cube. I'll save on that account. And then I'll log out on that account. No, not really. Uh, okay, what next? <laughs> okay, now we can put this cube down here, I suppose. Yeah, these cubes are solid, they don't have the- the wood grain texture that was in the previous maps in this series. It's a mod in an older version of B-Mod that, uh, if Paper Player updates B-Mod, and then recompiles the maps, it should work. But, there is currently a bug in it, in B-Mod, where publishing doesn't always update the map for some reason, so... Right, where do I want to go? Well, obviously to the end, right? Seems simple enough.
Hey! Perfect. Hold on a second. What do we have here? There was no mention of an optional companion cube. Now that I know that exists... No, wait, I have to do this the hard way. Let me, let me, let's pretend I didn't jump down. So let's see here, so I have to stay up here, right? Does this auto-respawn? Okay, I'm just curious about that. But let's say that in case I need it, let me do that. There we go. I'll do that first. Yeah, I was making a big deal out of nothing. Ha ha ha! I can't even bring it to the exit? Alright, well at least I found the easter egg, that's cool. Right. So. Let's get this done. Cool map. I think that was actually one of the, the most clever ones I've seen so far. Would've been cool if the light bridge got more use, but that's okay. Anyway, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I will see you all in another video. Goodbye!